Marines beat. Hunters beat. much oh they give it they give you an example no they don't why would they not give you any color on the screen to look at <laughs> oh wait we still have to actually find why we came in here i got sidetracked <laughs> Could, wait guys why am i auto shooting somebody help me out here Aim to fire. Get this out of here. I gotta say, it's really nice being able to manually reload. Meat bun. So uh, we're gonna get an, a higher combo than normal going into the first shot. I think normally we end around five, maybe six. Mostly five, I think. We're at six already. Being able to manually reload is really nice. Let's go, dude. Yeah, look, we're at eight already. Oh my god, that is a huge difference. SD, oh my god, get out of here. Wait, is it even purple? I didn't notice. Where's the cursor? It didn't even matter.
Did she get nerfed? I think the first bosses weren't affected, right? If I remember correctly. Oh, somebody has to remind me to try out the uh, platform dropping. Vision is really good for damage output. Wow! The guy came out of the wall and hit me. No. Ah, what a silly fight to get hit on. Little guy popped out of the wall. It's fine. This is fine. All right, let's see platform dropping. So this is why it's like the pro controls, right? You wouldn't be able to do this if you didn't have those controls on. And this could be important sometimes for dodging, right? Like the bullets are coming at you and you need to fall. Sometimes you see me get hit all the time because I'm trying to dodge a bullet and I land on the platform higher. Um, so now you can tech right through it. You could buy junk? That's a new one. I wish I didn't get hit so I can get homing bullets. We'll just save. Yo, we still never seen the snail. We unlocked him and he disappeared. Oh, you can see the ammo on the top now. Look at that. Nice. Really nice things to make the game feel good, like being able to shoot through the floor. Uh, it would be very triggering and not feel as good if you weren't able to and all your bullets were hitting the floor. Feels really good. There, I got to fall through the platform. I don't know how I didn't get hit there. RC again. Chest. It sucks that like so many like crap heads like made this game look bad on Steam for no reason. Like just because it's not the game that they wanted that they shouldn't have bought in the first place then. It makes me sad man. All this stuff is so good. It makes me sad. one oh the genie we never had this yet damn that nerf must have been big ah i'm on a 
touch. Damn, this does a lot of. Oh my god, I'm not paying attention. We never, we never get hit on this boss. This is warm up. I'm not even paying attention at this point. Yo, he died quick, considering. Dude, and then they'll be the first ones like, oh, I hope uh, I hope they make like another good game, like Enter the Gungeon and stuff, but going out of your way to hurt those, like, hurt those developers because you don't like that they created something different is like, it's like spitting in their face, I feel like. It's like, what are you doing? I'll take a damage up. I don't know. Whatever. This game is super sweet. I'll take a damage up. Oh, damn. We haven't done this in a long time. Remember how powerful this weapon was when you could tap fire it? I love some of these level designs. Being able to shoot the platforms is so good. Hey, right, look at them in the background. Whoa! Did you guys see that? It looked like the enemy from Yoshi's store, or Yoshi's Island. Am I bugging? That looks like the enemy from Yoshi's Island. No way. Oh god, I fell. Wait, if you fall through a platform, can you still dodge? It looks like yes. I wonder why I didn't dodge it. You could. I can see why people don't like that the game is different. Well, then go play Enter the Gungeon. Don't buy a new game and then expect it to be the same game. Does that make sense? <laughs> and then complain about it. That is different. Different games are different? What? Yeah, I don't see why. <laughs> and it's not that they don't like it. That's fine. But don't bring the devs that you want to support down because they made something different, right? That Then you're just hurting the devs. It's fine if you don't like the game, right? It's absolutely fine. But don't claim you're an Enter the Gungeon fan and then spit on them is like, is essentially what they're doing. More or less. <laughs> That's not okay. Yo, I could have sworn that that was a Yoshi's Island person. Birds are deadly in this game. You need to take those out quick. I forgot we have eye patch. So if I can, if they're with me, uh, I need to get in their face. This is a warm up. <laughs> this is warm up. 11 combo. At 12, it goes back to normal, right? Oh boy. Oh, 
I wonder if you can make that one. Yeah, you could. Did I just flawless him? That was a really good fight. Hence, like, when I'm paying attention, we just flawless one of the hardest bosses in the game, but I got hit to both of the easiest ones. <laughs> uh, when you have a popular franchise like that, it's not only yours. What? Are you joking me right now? How are you going to defend people like that? Like, they went on to make a new game. Looking at that game for more than five minutes, you know what the game is. They said it's a smaller game. It's a little arcadey game. They succeeded in making that. They succeeded in making that. This game was fun. It's fluid. It's fast. And they got to dish it out quick to give people more Gungeon to play with. They got to make it quick so that they can go on and make their next game. There's no defending that. There's no defending the people that are gonna go bash this game because it's not what they want. There's, there's, there's none of that. And again, we're not like, if you're new here, we're not like attacking anybody. We like, ha like have these conversations, but we definitely get passionate. <laughs> Yeah, what up, Pauls? How do you enable the ammo count? Um, in the newest update. In the newest update. It's just really sad to see. It's really sad to see. Dumbledore. We're broke. I keep getting hit. We're at 15. We're at 15 right now. To the new movement. There's new movement in this update, by the way, so there's a lot of new tech and movement that you can like pull off to dodge better. Damn, Esty, I love you saying things like that. We don't attack anybody, but we just get passionate. Okay, I'm drunk and lurking while playing Warband. <laughs> Yo, Larson, I love you, man. I love you. <laughs> Is it all by default in the newest update? I believe so. Yep. <laughs> okay, I'm drunk. Dude, I'm glad you're having an awesome time, man, Larson. Enjoy your lurk, man. <laughs> Thanks for popping out and saying that. It's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, man. We're not like, you know, everyone's entitled to their own. Yo, didn't you guys say Galactic Valor last time is absolutely amazing? Isn't this like damage against bosses or something? Yo, flak bullets is also amazing though. But uh, this is this is great, right? Yeah, no, I just want everyone to know, like, especially if they've never been here, they may think that we're like, ah, you're wrong. But like, no, nah, we, you know, we like to talk about this stuff. Dude, them making a mobile version. There's nothing wrong. Get this in your heads, guys. There's nothing wrong with them choosing to make a game that also works on your phone that you can carry a gungeon around in your pocket. There's nothing wrong with that. I actually thought it was awesome. There's nothing wrong with that. It's a great game. 
Then they wanted to bring it to PC and Switch because people were asking for it. Awesome. That's a great thing. Not only that, they added also like a bunch of custom things that you can also do on the PC version because the mobile phone version can't have it. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> Just because the game is on mobile doesn't make it a bad game. Some of the best roguelikes to come out this year, some of the best roguelikes and the most um, creativity has come out of mobile games that I found this year. It's just that gamers, they don't even know why, have this very negative connotation where if you put a game on mobile, it's bad, it's wrong. It's wrong for developers to make money. It's wrong to put a game. I'm so happy that they put, they have this on mobile. I think that's awesome. In addition, the game was designed to be used with controllers, so mobile doesn't even matter here, frankly. Timed exclusive isn't good in my opinion. I got a I got a a rude awakening for you. That's been happening for a long time. That's been happening forever. I'm sorry to wake you up. That's been happening forever. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> let's see if he can land. Ow! Why'd he throw a beer at me? Throw it. Let's see what you got. I believe in him. Come on. Kobe? Kobe? Is he not gonna do it? Oh, Kobe, 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 Kobe. Ah! One day, one day. I hope it will be enough money. Well, people are literally hurting them by like, ah, oh, this game is nothing like Gungeon. Gungeon's better. It's not supposed to be Gungeon. It's not supposed to be Enter the Gungeon. What phone roguelikes? Uh, we've showcased some of them, actually, Vicky. Now, hit me up in the Discord. I can definitely pitch you some. I'm just sick of people, like, having the mindset. They're having the mindset because they're adopting it from other people. And, and they don't even know why they have that mindset. <laughs> they just borrowed it from somebody else, and they think they know what they're talking about. Stop hurting devs because of like your ignorance. And I'm not saying you're like to somebody in chat. I'm saying you're like just people in general. Devs work way too damn hard to deal with so much crap. <laughs> it makes me sick. <laughs> like half the time they don't even make good money. They're like, this isn't like even be worth it. It's insane, dude. Yo, the nerfs on these people were killing them so much bad. Oh my god. This guy first. This guy first. Thank you. That tech. Alright, you can go now. That was a good room. Like, yeah, I wish Final Fantasy wasn't going to PS4 first. Yes, but I get it. <laughs> And I'm still gonna love, I can't wait to pick it up when it comes to PC. I love the video games. I don't care what platform they're on. Too? We flawless some of the hardest bosses so far. Yo, let's go! <gasps> Gilded bullets. Oh man, dude, we're killing this right now. Imagine in a world where we shut on Super Mario RPG, not a side scroller. <laughs> Nintendo exclusive. because they thought it would be a sequel to Enter the Gungeon. Yep. 
I don't think they were misinformed. Just like one, that devs are very bad at selling their game. Two, they never hid what this game was gonna be. They never did, never hid it. Yeah. If people wanted to know what it was before they blindly purchased it, if they really cared about what kind of game it was, they could have found out. gun it's powerful on bosses it's powerful on bosses but if it comes at the wrong time you're in trouble the worst gun i'll show you the worst gun when i find it i'll show you i'll show you the worst gun in the game there's two but i think one of them got a buff one of them was a charged weapon but i'm pretty sure it got buffed in the last patch which was really nice Fastball through platforms now. Uh, these guys need to die first. Yeah, right here. This is a big room. I like it. I love these, some of these levels, man. So cool. The creativity and the level design in a lot of these. Wood gun? I haven't tried that one yet. I don't think I've found it, Alu. What up, man? Welcome, everybody. Hope everyone's day is going well, man. Hope everyone's holding out healthy. Thanks for uh, coming through to spend some time with us. You see how I just fast fell through platforms? Without the new tech, like, you wouldn't be able to do that. It's very important. If you want to get better at this game, to turn that on. It's very important. There's a lot of crazy stuff you can do with it now. Shrink rate! This, this thing makes me think of Gru. Gru? Freeze rate! shouldn't have. I had no idea you could break uh, chests in this game. Star Frost! Candy's uh, damage up and health up. Candy's amazing. Yeah, Vicky, absolutely. Absolutely. For example, I just see that it's not my thing, so I don't buy it. Yeah. everything up ah that's sweet but all right let's just push everybody off the platform this is my platform i am the captain now birds must die these are bad these are bad Ah, I didn't even see the fire guy, like a chump. that we got hit has a lot to say he mentioned level design gameplay and the fact that the game is not that big like people are allowed to give it good like bad reviews like that's fine but if they have their reasons right like so like what he said is fine if that's what he thinks right one i think the level design in this game is amazing for a platformer all the creativity and the level design is so damn good um, 
The game's not that big. I mean, in the beginning, it doesn't seem that big, so he probably didn't get very far, so I could see that too. Um, that being said, all I'm saying, guys, is don't go to Steam reviews wondering if a game is good. Find somebody that you trust. Find somebody that's actually a gamer to give you a fair review. That's what I always encourage you guys to do. A lot of amazing, amazing games that could have been on my game of the year list have mixed or negative reviews because people have no idea what they're talking about on Steam. You guys know that. We see that time and time again. Wingman. We see that time and time again, unfortunately. It's sad, but it's just it's just the world. People have no idea what they're talking about when it comes to games. <laughs> Game bad. Game bad. Oh, we're at the boss and I didn't buy anything. Whoops. Whoops, but I think we'll be okay. All right, let's see how the boss has changed. Apparently they nerfed his health a little bit and they slightly adjusted some of his patterns. So I don't know what that means. Um, we'll see. This was also a pretty bad run, but. This should be interesting. I think we'll be okay. Especially if he's even easier now. This is slower. That's a, a little slower. What the hell gun is this? What the hell is this thing? I never had this before. Damn it, we got hit. Tell me that weapon sucks. I agree. <laughs> oh, candy. damage over the left. Wow, they nerfed the crap out of him. He's dead already? Oh, yeah, we're about to start streaking this game. And this was a bad run. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, 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 wow. A lot of his patterns come out a lot slower. Holy cow. Like anytime you guys see, uh, we do a showcase on this on, on the show. That's why we, it's very important. We always talk about like the kind of game it is. I um, mean, like, what people would be into the game, all the good things that it does, and then we talk about, like, places that it could improve, you know what I mean? And that's why we touch on all bases. I think it's very important. Yo, that boss just got slapped. Loot bag, ooh. It's nice that they brought the loot bag from Payday over to this, too. Is there, uh, is there after bosses, like, in the dungeon, like, hard mode bosses? I'm not really sure, to be honest, man. I'm sure that there's more to see. Um, I still have to unlock robot. I still have to do all this like crazy elevator stuff. So I don't think we've seen it all yet. Let's get another win. That was a really bad run too. Ratskin boots. GG's.
Mediocre run, but it worked out. I think we just have to beat it with bullet now, which is like a harder path, but we can do it.